what's wrong with how you naturally look? Do you believe you have to have so much color to your face? Do you believe you have to paint up your face so much to where you don't look like how you naturally look? Like you look like another person? Do you believe you have to wear clothes that pretty much expose your body, like show pieces or the shape of your behind, showing cleavage, having an open back, as in not wearing any material, material covering your back? Do you believe you have to appear as something else to be accepted? Do you feel like if you don't wear any weave, any makeup, or tight clothing, do you believe you would appear as an old-fashioned woman? Or do you believe you would look like an old woman? Let me say this. I don't think there is anything wrong with modestly wearing makeup. You know, I think a person can place on makeup to where it is too much, to where they are looking for that seductive look. Okay. Let me say this. I think with some people, I think one of the bad things of makeup, let me say this. If a person is not wearing the weave, not having the makeup on and the tight clothes, their personality may be a certain way maybe they will be soft spoken maybe humble maybe a bit shy or whatever but if they put the weave on the makeup and the tight clothes i think with some people this may not be true for everyone but i think with some people they become arrogant. Like, it's like a new personality overtakes them or is set there. It's like with some people, I think they become arrogant, prideful, rude, and all this other stuff. I think if you are like that, if you notice your personality changes, once you put on the extras, the weave and the makeup and the tight clothes and stuff like that, leave makeup alone. If you become a worse person by placing that stuff on, leave it alone. Let me say this too. I think there are different themes in how you can dress. You know, I guess there is a Western theme or cow cowboy cowgirl theme you know different types of themes okay i think the theme i see so often and i may not have the word correct in it but it seems like so many people are dressing in this sexy theme like trying to look sexy like Oh, man. Like having a very seductive look. Not only that, but dressing improperly. Like wearing clothes you probably shouldn't even wear when you are in the bed sleeping. Look now. Some people may say, if they don't wear 
clothes like that or appear in that sexy theme, they may say they may look old if they don't dress in that way or appear in that way. Some people may say, people may tease them for looking properly. Imagine that. Look now. I think if you are placing so much makeup on your face to where you look like something else, I think if you are covering your real hair and putting some type of hair that doesn't even fit your race or suits your race and you wearing clothes exposing your body, I think that is really going to make you feel low about yourself. How can you really say you love yourself if you are placing a mask on? Yes, I think makeup is a huge mask. And I don't think makeup is wrong, but I think for many people, why they use makeup, I think that is wrong. If, if you are wearing stuff on your face, covering the way you really look, and placing hair on your head that's not yours, but you are doing it because you don't like how your natural hair is, I believe you will or, or already have a self-esteem problem, which I am not trying to be rude or anything like that. What is wrong with how you naturally look? Like, you don't need a lot of color on your face. I think, honestly, I think some makeup messes up some people's faces. You don't need all that color in your face. You don't have to wear a mask. Everyone, everyone can't look pretty or can't be pretty. Yes, I think everyone can't be pretty. But if you are doing stuff, seeking for attention, all attention is not good attention. You can get attention by doing what is wrong, but the attention that you may receive most likely in many cases, I believe, won't be to your benefit. Dress properly. Now, the way I see it, the way I see it, if a person won't accept you for how you naturally look, and if they are basing everything on your looks and not how you are and and your personality and how you think and stuff like that, that may be a person you don't want to really involve yourself with, right? If they are only looking at the surface and judging you based upon that, ah, oh, that person covers her body. <laughs> that person is looking so proper. I don't want that person. That person is old school or whatever. If a person is like that, isn't it a good thing that person isn't interested in you? You don't have to look or try to look like the prettiest thing out there. You don't need to put on a mask what if what if i chose <laughs> what if i chose to put this on my face <laughs> don't i look so pretty well the thing you would probably say kevin you have some tissue on your face so how can you say this this makes me look handsome when this isn't me. Like I have something on my face covering how I really look. So how is how is this me? I have something on my face, right? 
Okay. What is makeup? Is makeup really you? Yes, you may be very talented and can do some really stuff, some stuff on your face to make you look like something else, but is that really you? Once you wash that stuff off, is that really you? Is this really me? I have it on my face, right? And I am showing it, <laughs> I am showing it to you right now, but is this really me? Look now. I don't think there is anything wrong with makeup, but if you are in the way that I am describing about makeup and stuff like that, I think you should do away with all that stuff. Accept how you are. If, if your friends, friends won't accept you for how you look, stay away from them. Find new friends that are not vain, I guess I can say. You don't have to be accepted by everyone. See, I believe that is exposing problems within yourself. Maybe you have a spirit of rejection. Maybe you have self-esteem problems. What is wrong with how you naturally look? Everyone can't be tens or nines or eights. Even if you don't look too well, so what? I believe if you ask God for a spouse, I believe if you are patient, I believe he will give you one. If you are patient and willing to follow him and do what he says and stuff like that, I believe he will give you one. I pray this makes sense. Like, this isn't me. This is something covering the way I truly look. So I can't take pride in a mask or something covering me up, can I? Let me stop here. God bless you.